Well, good morning, guys. It's the first day of the Harrisville Tournament. This is the Constant Outdoorsman. We are on the boat this morning, and we're going to go into a little introduction here. That's got Miss Stacy. is Captain Stacy for today. Hello. And Stacy, what boat are we on today? A Sabo K. Yeah, Sabo K. All righty. So we're going to kind of walk you through about how we're getting set up this morning. Uh, this is uh, Don and his boat, and there's uh, Rich Tack. He's up there as well getting set up. They're getting some meat rigs set up. So we got a couple uh, downriggers. We're going to run nine lines today. So we've got uh, a couple downriggers already set up, 12-pound balls. And then we've got our big long line out the back, a couple uh, lead cores. And we're running four regular lines as well this morning. So we're going to be running some meat rigs and some spoons as well. So, hey, this is Consummate Outdoorsman on the Sabo King, and we're going to catch some fish. We're going to win the Harrisville Tournament. See you soon. Well, we're fixing to take it off. Here we go. It is the start of the Harrisville Tournament. All right, we got several other competitions out there. The smoked salmon's out there. We got three boats coming in behind us. There goes one, headed out. Waves are really good this morning. It's the Ladies' Day Tournament. All right, boys, here we go. Got one landing, got another one going. Two fish on, double header. All right, we got another one on. Keep it up. Got Captain Stacy back here. Got the netter going. I just heard it clicking. Yeah. Did you see it, you see it again? I was looking at her ass, sorry. <laughs> Whoa! All right, we got a runner. When you're reeling, you don't hear the clicking. It's not reeling in. No, it's because he was pulling. Well, that's good. He runs. Let him run. All right, we got a head shaker. He's a tree shaker, boys. Got good color. Big fish. Nice big fish. Now, can you turn his right a little bit, or left a little bit? Left. Left a little bit. Up on top. There he is. Keep him down, Stacy. Nicely done. That was on the long line again. That's the second one for the long line. Same color. Last time we had this one, we had a double on. Oh, that's a heavy fish. Fish in the net. There we go. Woo! Number yeah. three in the box, baby. Okay, so we're going to be rigging up a, it's called a Mad Moo. Now, the Mad Moo tackle, very specific to Lake Huron. So, I'm going to show you Rich's tack. He's hooking one up here. Let me get over here where I can get a good shot at it. All right, Rich, so tell us what you're using right there. A nail wipe. Okay. <laughs> i got to cut it down because I'm going to use a bullet roll, which All is right. just going to rotate the... The fish in the, uh, in the it's going to rotate the fish behind the flasher. You're taking a toothpick and running it through there so it holds it on there. Yeah. All right. If I get a toothpick in there, gonna stick his head right up inside of it, trimmed it up a little bit. And just so it fits in there. And then I'll just. Fish on the... I'm sorry, I wasn't even watching. Got a stinger hook on it. Yeah, and then what I'm going to do to help it roll, I'm going to take this and just curve it a little bit. Peg him in there. So, so, see how that's way too much bend. So, I got to 
scoop in and it just also helps hold the fish in there. Right. Well, that's how you rig the mad move. Well, we're back out here and now the rain has really started. So you see we got a dipsy diver, downrigger, two planer boards, a long line and two planer boards and downrigger and a, mad, and a, a dipsy diver as well. So we got three in the box and we've only been at it just uh, about an hour and a half. Talk to you later. Stacy's got, she got one. All right, we got another one on. There he is, he's on top of the water. Keep reeling him in, you're doing good. So we got six already in the boat so far today. The ladies are kicking tail. They are kicking the fish. All right, if you're not hearing it click, turn the, turn the, the drag. Rich, the drag's not set. Alright, so we've got as much of that uh, stuff, like algae and stuff like that on the tip. So what's happened is that the drag is not, you know, pulled through. So we got to pull that out and it's on the notch, right on the monofilament, right on the notch. So you, sometimes at this point here, you can lose a fish if you're not careful. Game on again. There he is. Oh, head shaker. Nice fish. Right in the mouth. No, it's a laker. All right. Got another fish in the boat. This is our way in. Here we go, a six fish. Good morning, guys. This is the Consummate Outdoorsman. We are here day two of the fishing tournament out of Harrisville. And uh, we're out on the Sunrise Coast. Look at that beautiful sunrise. We're on the Asabo K, and we're going to get out here for the Super Bowl tournament Saturday and Sunday. And we'll get her started this morning. We're going to get rigged up here. We're going to run some mad moves this morning. And uh, we're going to run out probably about a four mile run this morning. So I wanted to make sure that you guys get all the information. Let me show you some of the other boats that are going out. There's Erica 2. Several other boats right there. See, they're doing some dredging. And there's the rest of the fleet headed out this morning. Well, hey, this is the Consummate Outdoorsman. We'll catch you here shortly. We're going to show you some fish this morning. Stand by. All right, we got our first fish on. Uh, we had one on earlier, but we got a first one that's going to be landed here. And the first one's gonna be landed. We've had two on, and uh, this guy had one as a swing and a miss, and he uh, got it all the way to the boat, and it's it saying it come right off on a hot and tot. All right, so this is a good fish. We've been fighting it for probably about five minutes so far. A big head shaker. All right, so Captain Stacy, what did we catch that on? We caught that on a green scale mad moo meat rig. All right, so you kind of see how we've been and Alan, doing some of these. Alan will show you when it gets in. Yeah, we got him on top of the water already. So we'll keep him right there, keeping the rod tip up. 
That Mad Moo is just absolutely an incredible, incredible bait. Yeah, you don't want to put too much drag on it. You're better off to bring him up and drill down on it. There you go, right there. Don't take one. There you Captain go. Rich is giving her instruction. There, exactly what you want to do. Right there, that's all you do. It's just braided. You don't want to point it at him. Now, why is that? Because there's no stretch in the braided at all. Monofilament will stretch, the braided doesn't stretch. And especially with those Mad Moo rigs. Yep. So you're using the the, uh, the bend in the rod to help cushion the, the fight. So with, with those, so Captain Stacy, with those Mad Moo rigs, you guys rig them just a little bit different than most people. While she's still fighting that fish. Yes, we do. We put two hooks on. We use a treble hook and a single kicker. It's a stinger hook, basically. Stinger, yeah, basically. It's a, a, a number four at, or five at we use, and um, the other one is uh, we use a mustang and an octopus. Right on. Well, we're still fighting him. That's a solid fish right there. We've seen him come top of the water. We got Warren here, which is Rich's dad. He's going to be doing the landing of the fish. So we're going to get you a bird's eye view of landing this fish. That is a big fish. Yesterday we had this have we had a double on. So hopefully we'll get another one tag here in a second. And we'll be screaming fish on. Fighting it hard. She got that game face going today. The Mad Moo game face. Way to go, Jody. Big fish. Nope, he's hooked right in the mouth. Tell me. Keep going, keep reeling, keep reeling, keep reeling. All right, one in the net on the Mad Moo Tackle. Thirty-six point zero. Thirty-six point zero.